was a World War II bomber pilot, Frank Dial went on many tough missions. Today, it was family and friends who attempted the near impossible mission of honoring the 85-year-old with a surprise celebration. Cynthia Williams has more on this veteran's life and legacy of service. At 85 years old, Frank Dial has braved many a storm and fought many a battle as a World War II bombardier stationed at Seething Airfield on the eastern coast of England. Frank Dial was a young man with a wife and a little girl when he enlisted in the Army Air Corps. Today, Mr. Frank, as he's known by co-workers, yes, co-workers, was treated to a film retrospective of a phenomenal military career that included the bombing of Hitler's capital. In the early hours of March 6, 1944, Frank's crew learned that their target that day would be Berlin. We are in awe of what you did, of what you do. And I was just one of 16 million people over there. And I take my head off to everyone. And Today, it was hats off to Mr. Frank and the gift of a replica flight jacket. Very much like the flight jacket I had. Good, Mr. Frank. Yeah. At times, the emotion was too much. A Display of medals included one flight. that was given to Mr. Frank's younger brother, James, who made the ultimate sacrifice. Well, that's my brother's Marine. That's the one I'm the proudest of. <laughs> he had been at Guadalcanal. Mr. Frank's son, Sam. He doesn't consider himself a hero, but, but we do. Over the past several years, Mr. Frank has been working in insurance, offering protection to others. Yet, on this day before Veterans Day, it was Alpha Vision employees who thanked a reluctant World War II hero for how, in his youth, he was the one protecting life, liberty, and the American way. It brings back a lot of memories. And thank you so much. We love you. Okay. Well, Mr. Frank and his crew flew 33 missions in a B-24 bomber known as the Menace. And he says they hardly ever missed. Demetrius. Boy, he still looks sharp in that bomber jacket, too. Cynthia, do you think he was actually surprised today? Well, y you know, Demetrius, he promises that he was surprised, but I have an 80-year-old mother. And, like, surprising her is like trying to surprise an all-seeing, all-knowing God <laughs> who's just a bit nosy. So... <laughs> I, I don't know, believe it. <laughs> I know what you mean. Thanks. Sure. Well, Steve McNair still.